Well, in the lead up to Election Day, News 19 continues to bring you candidate updates. Mike Durant has been criticized in recent weeks for his lack of commitment to a statewide debate by his opponents, Katie Brett and Mo Brooks. News 19's Kayla Smith joins us now in the studio. You actually spoke to Mike Durant. I did. At a campaign appearance in Birmingham last night, News 19 asked Durant if he is willing to join Britt and Brooks on the debate stage prior to the May 24th primary election. His response? It's been an issue of scheduling. Yeah, we're fine with debates. I mean, you know, we've got a schedule that's laid out, but if we can fit it in, we'll be glad to do it. It's not scheduled right now, but, you know, my team is in conversations with everybody that wants to do it. Behind the scenes, debate organizers say the Durant team hasn't made any commitment. Alabama Republican Chairman John Wall told News 19 earlier this week, I have not gotten confirmation for Durant to participate in a statewide debate, and there is conflicting information about it. Both Britt and Brooks have expressed their interest in a debate, but the Britt campaign says her participation is contingent on Durant's agreement to appear. In the wake of Durant's comments last night, the rival campaigns renewed their criticism. The Brick campaign says, quote, various TV networks, the Alabama Republican Party and local Republican clubs throughout the state have been trying to organize various debates and forums for months with one common theme, silence from Mike Durant. It's sad that Mike Durant expects people to believe that he's ghosted all of these proposed events because of his schedule. The guy has been a ghost on the campaign trail as well. The Brooks campaign is also critical of Durant's current lack of commitment, saying if Mike Durant is sincere about being ready to face the voters and quit the Hyden Joe Biden approach, then he'll find a way to make a debate work. He knows where to find us. For more information about the upcoming primary election, you can visit whnt.com.